Hello, humans and pets. We got cheese it popcorn. We got Taki's crisps. We got TGI Friday's cheddar cheese flavored baked crunchy fries. And we also got some original onion ring snacks. So those were a gift from someone that Ryan's mother works with. Yeah. I don't remember who it was. These I bought at the store the other day because A, we like Takis, but I've never seen them in a, in a little crisper container. It says face like intensity on the go. And cheese it popcorn. How do you not like that? So, so we're, we're going to give them all a try. Give them all a try. So what do you want to start with? Onion rings or french fries? Or uh, let's do french fries. You want to try french fries? I'm thinking these are going to, I hope they taste like hot fries. Do you know hot fries? Those are phenomenal. I but do they love They come in a small bag fries. and they yeah. always want money. So this is a small bag. It looks like hot fries, but it does not smell like hot fries. Mm. Yeah, definitely. They do look like french fries. I'm going to think potato sticks. Hmm. That's appropriate. It's unseasoned, just like everything we ever got from TGI Fridays. <laughs> What do you think? Imagine like a hot fry. Without flavor? That tastes like a Funyun, but a Funyun without onion. No, I was gonna say, it doesn't taste like a Funyun at all. It has the texture of like a hot fry and a Funyun. It has the texture, but it really And then is. the flavor of nothing. It says cheddar cheese too, like what did they forget to put it on it? It really is, they're it's like salt and mediocre only. at best. Not bad. 78 79 cents. I forgot what she said. That one just had cheese. The one I just got there. Yep, yeah, I guess they're all right. They really are not. Give me hot fries. Hot fries are good. With the little guy on the phone. We got four of them. You're eating them? Yeah, I guess so. This is uh, first so far. What'd you say? A four? Well, can you put them in your mouth? No. This is the first one. Oh, it's the first. I'm going to rate it a 5 out of 10. I'll give it a 6. It's, just, it's relatively average. I've That's had about those, it. So. I don't know what was worse. I'm on these taste like onions, but they're weirdly colored. They're brown. They, they smell. Look at Smell them. The same thing the last one smelled like. It smells like, like the bag. It, like, a tent. That you haven't opened since it rained last That's year. What it, That's it. Yeah. yeah. It smells like a tent. These are better. No. They're better than them. Mm -mm. Not at all. I almost taste it burnt. Is that like, are they, did they burn them? That's how it looks like on the bag, but I don't like it. It's a bad bunion. Mm -hmm. That's basically what that is. I mean, they're not horrible. They're really small. They're not horrible, but they're, they're, they kind of have the bunion taste. They're just not fun. Or nyan. <laughs> yeah, 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 that's right? the point. Yeah, that's good. Yeah, Funyuns are phenomenal. Hot Funyuns might be the best snack on the market. Some hot Funyuns are really good. Yeah, but these, these are okay. Uh, I think I like them better than the chips. Mm -mm. I'd take these any day. I'm gonna give that one like a two. Yeah. You think so? I think yeah. the onion flavor at least comes out a little bit. These are kind of bland. Cause... No. Five at best. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to tie them. Two. Do we want to go hot or we want to go popcorn? We want to drink. I don't hot. think either one of them hot. Yeah. All right. Well, we might break the popcorn flavor then. So it's a Pringle. It, it definitely coming out looking like a Pringle. They have less of an arch. No, that's what a Pringle looks like. No. Mmm. Nice little heat to it. 
I can taste the lime, really. You can taste the lime. Yeah, like hockey. Ooh, that was a nice hot one right there. They didn't. They weren't shy on the amount of uh, seasoning they put on there, much like Takis. Mm -hmm. And it's actually got a nice little spice to so it. The good thing I like about it is that all the seasonings on the side that you put tongue down. Well, you're weird like that. Although I just did it. I'm not gonna lie. It actually has a lot of flavor. But. Is it a Taki flavor? Mm. Yeah. How come I think Takis have more lime on them, usually? Like this, I don't remember any flavor it's I had of Takis. That tastes different. Is that what it is? Definitely. Is it usually a corn That's chip? That's different I'm tasting. It's usually a corn chip? Or whatever it is, it's a Taki. I mean, a nice open container, travel size. Nine. I don't mind these. I'll give them a nine. Although they are getting salty to me. Yeah, now eat one of them and tell me that's that that's a that's more than a five. Six. Wow. They're kind of mediocre, but they're better than those. So. Really, try them. Again. No. I'm trying again. Ooh. So, this is a cheese it pop. The corn. I to look at them. It looked like it was gonna be like the uh, pirate booty, but to look at them, they look like popcorn. Yeah, they do. Don't they? I gotta say, it was a full bag. It was like I'm pretty cheese obsessed. So when cheese it's meets popcorn, prepare your taste buds for 100% real big cheese taste you've been waiting for. Okay, let me let me clear my cheese face. Let me eat some of these cheese. No, I left you an onion. Right. Those just aren't good. They taste like... No way you like them more than these. I don't like either one of them. I'm glad we protest TGI Fridays, to be honest with you. They, they can't even put a chip out, right? Popcorn. Yeah. Cheese it. Popcorn. I get butter right off the bat, not cheese. Very buttery. But I do taste cheese at cheese. At the end, the first thing I get is a nice buttery flavor. And then they I get, get the cheese. Right. This is actually competing with Smart. I will say one thing about this one. We recently just did that popcorn with the marshmallow and the whatever. And I it wasn't bad. But what no, I... It's kind of bad. He didn't like it. But what? So I went back and tried it again. So I said, oh, maybe I'll like it. I took a small little bowl of it. I was going to eat it like a snack. Every one of the pop corn kernels was unpopped, hot as a rock. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I was just about to say, these are very soft. These are popped properly. Every one of them. I could. I ended up throwing half the bowl away because I couldn't eat it. And I don't mind eating like popcorn kernels. They might kernels. have been because, um, you know, it's gourmet. I know, but they, they just they hand popped it come with that. They electrified it with running on. Treadmill. You know, I don't mind. Like when I I used to pop my own popcorn all the time. Sometimes you get some that aren't even pop mm -hmm. or half pop. One or two here and there, not a big deal. Crunch right through them. But uh, that one was really cheesy, cheesy. Yeah. Some of them these are these are hit or miss. Sometimes you get that really butter. Sometimes you get that nice hit of the, the, the cheese at cheese. It's good because you normally grab a handful of popcorn anyways. Mm -hmm. These are really good. Ten. I'm giving it a 10 out of 10 on these. Mm. And I got I got to be honest with you, the content of the actual popcorn itself, it's like a, it's like they used quality popcorn to do it. Like these are all fully popped up. Your bag is full to the bed. It was filled. It, it was enough to just open it. No, I don't know how much this was. I have the receipt right there pulled up. Oh. I, 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 I threw one in. I forget. I think the Takis was maybe two ninety nine or something like that. Three fifty six. Three fifty six. It was one ninety eight for the Takis. Three fifty six for this. Yeah. One ninety eight. Yeah. So I knew it was. I thought I said it was like two bucks. Mm -hmm. So 
Overall, I, this popcorn, I, I'm going to eat this whole I bag. I can eat it all. Uh-huh. Those That's are all. really good. Yeah. Nice, buttery, when cheesy movie, flavor. When start selling that, I'll come, come and visit. It has a nice... It's it's like a dual flavor. Like you get a little butter and you get a little cheese. Far superior. I don't even want to look at that. You gotta try it. No, it's gonna. It, this is supposed to have you cheese on it. No, they're not. No, it tastes like a dirty yeah, tank. Try it, I can. No, that just puts bad flavors in my mouth. These are good. Mm -hmm. These I really like. That combination, that's actually really nice. They kind of remind me, they do have that hint of a cheese it though at the very end. Like you get that yeah. little laugh. But what they did is rather than just like, what I'm thinking, right? It's a good cheese popcorn. That's so what they that took is. it, they took a cheese it, and then they popped it, and this is what came out. Yeah, instead of popcorn kernels, they put cheese it's in the thing. This this one's actually, these are actually pretty good. Now, they, is popcorn just corn? Yeah. Fair enough. None of them are hard. That's what I'm saying. I, I kept going back, mainly because I'm hungry, but also because I wanted to see. That other bag, the, the little bit we yeah. ate wasn't bad, but as as I, I poured a little bowl of it, I couldn't even get through. I was crunching so bad. Now, one good thing, right, with this, it doesn't leave that much of a residue on your hands. Mm -mm. I mean, it does. But there is flavor. But compared to smart food, you well, gotta power wash your hands after those. I, I am a smart food. I used to love smart food. In yeah, fact, so you used to love the store brand. I used to, actually, I was just gonna say, I believe it was Shaw's when I used to shop there all the time. They had a big bag of loaded. And that one was really good. And that was reminding me of this one because it had like some cheese and all kinds of flavors on it. And uh, this tastes like a used quality popcorn. Yeah. And I don't know if there is a difference. I know growing up, we always used Oval Redenbacher because his popcorn supposedly popped better. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And you get it, I did it. It was just one of them things. And when I moved out, I'm like, yeah, I get the cheap stuff. And sometimes you get something that just don't pop and stuff like that. But you just get the microwavable bag. And I used to do that a lot because I used to take them to work with me and stuff like that. But this does taste like you have a, a superior corn that they made like it like it you know like a it's just a quality it popped. popped it popped nice these are all perfectly popped so however they're doing it they're doing it right unlike that other bag where i'm sure what they do is they sort through it so that way you only get the good ones which would be awesome the other bag i only got the bad ones so i don't know yeah, but overall good. i highly recommend the cheese it popped Corn. I, I do recommend the Takis Crisp. I found them with it. They were just sitting in the... Uh, and I even more so, I recommend these. The TGI Fridays. I recommend you leave them right on the shelf where they were. That's what, That's I, what I was going to say. Oh, is that what you're I doing? I was going to say, don't, I recommend you not to even growl. You you're know. eating them right now, so they can't be bad. But Because I don't know who he's going to. It's so he can tell me he's full. He doesn't want to eat supper. But that, that that's what it is. There's, there's his supper right there, but... I don't, I don't think either one of them, and I'm not even just crapping on them because it says Fridays. Because yeah. I actually like Funyuns. I, they're one of my and favorite snacks. And I love snacks, the hot fries. And I love the hot fries. So I was kind of excited. But they really do taste like a tasteless version of both of them. They, they do. Like, it, no, I don't want any more. It doesn't taste good. So, but there you go. We can keep this one short and sweet. Uh, definitely get, definitely get, get, definitely get them if you dare type of a deal. Uh, I mean, it, it you know, I'm sure their fries and their onion rings are better at the store. But these just, you know, I, I kind of had high hopes for it. Because even, like, Jimmy John's had a nice, they had their chips and stuff. And we didn't mind that. But, uh -huh. but everything they seem to put out has been a disappointment. It, it has. And, it, and we're not even trying to The only one good them. thing was the pound of ch cheese fries. Yeah, and that but was then, a, was, you know, you got nice. the Nacho Grande box party pack. That we did a talk yeah. about like 
few days a week after, yep. it was way better. So yeah, actually, someone just did a thing, and you didn't go get it. I think it was Applebee's had the uh, appetizer was the pound of they had a, they did their own version of the uh, chili cheese fries, but you didn't you wouldn't go get it. No, we really. so, want to see it, we can. We can, uh, we can. They they do. They may. I don't know if they still have it. They they have new irresistibles there. Yeah. We did a few of them before. So I remember being decent. Mm-hmm. They were good. Now we did do the um the cheese crusted Cordova before in a prior episode. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't realize that. I, I was kind of giving them crap yesterday because uh, one of our friends had asked. Done for the whole week. We're at. Well, because they asked if we're going to do it, and I'm like, Ryan, it's new. It's a, I didn't realize they already came out with one. I, I remember doing the Parmesan crusted, uh, not the thin, I got Papadilla, and I remember doing the, the Chip hard to, like, Chipotle, Chipotle had a uh, quesadilla, too. I remember doing that one. I didn't remember doing Cordova's case in the I really didn't, but he showed me the, the video we did on it. But that's what happens when you do a year's worth of videos. You can't, you know, when one item leaves and then it comes back, I can't remember everything I've done. Mm -hmm. Between, I mean, we have well over probably 400 videos on there. So thank you for all that are subscribed and that are watching them. I, we do appreciate it, but I, it's just hard to remember every single video you've done. Yeah. Because we've done a decent amount. Mm -hmm. No, definitely. So, well, there you go. Um, and he's done a decent amount over there on his channel. You haven't seen any of them compared to what he has in the vault. Yeah, we got to come up with something new. We've been trying to crank out videos and do... Yeah, it's uh, over of like 800 videos recording. I don't have 800 videos recording, but I, I, I have enough that it filled up my camera so that I, I, I have a problem right now. So we have to figure that out, but... Might have to adjust the schedule. I'm thinking that's my best route. So. All right, well, there you go. There is Ryan's chip review for today. I was trying to do something else, but he, we got all these. We got a bunch of different stuff. Uh, there's all, so much new stuff that we have here at the house uh, that came out in the yeah. supermarket wise. Plus, there's a couple new things out uh, fast food wise that. He's iffy on whether we want to do or not. So stay tuned. We got lots of more good stuff coming up. And uh, that's that. There's our video. Uh, there's our review. Thanks for watching and hope you enjoyed the video.